Junkies out, junkies, I hope you have been well. Well, this little recipe is infamous New Orleans. I personally love going to New Orleans, I've been there twice, with the mix of Creole and Cajun. The food in New Orleans is amazing! And so are these little things, they're called pralines, and I'm going to show you how to make them right now. Okay guys, to get started, first thing we're going to do is pop in our caster sugar. Then we've got some light brown sugar, tightly packed. We've got our milk, and this is full cream milk, by the way, guys. Then we've got our butter. All the measurements are listed below for you, and they're listed in grams and milk, so you can use this anywhere you are in the world. And then we've got some pecans, which I have roughly chopped. Try and get your pecans similar sizes. That'll make the pralines a little bit uniform. And to finish off, a good dash of vanilla. Then we take it to the stove. So we want to put all this on the heat, on a medium heat, and we want to allow it all to melt and combine together and then come to the boil. Once it does start coming to a boil, you want to check it for a soft ball stage. So you want to be able to test it by taking a little bit of that toffee that you've made and popping it in a glass of water. If it holds a ball shape, it's good. If it completely disperses and runs into the water, you need to boil it more. So once you've got to that time, it's now take it off the heat and get those guns of steel out because we are now have to mix. So you wanna mix this and mix this and mix this until it becomes creamy and cloudy and the pecans stay in the mixture so they don't move around. They wanna hold their shape. That's when you are done making that part. Now to make these pralines set, we need to blind out some parchment paper. I put some newspaper underneath because this is hot. And then you just need to scoop out your pralines. You can make them any size you like. You can make one size, one big one, one small one. I went for about, you know, cookie size. But they will obviously be a little bit unique and not perfectly uniform because they have the pecans in them. Allow these to cool. They will harden. And there you have it. New Orleans pralines, these are really easy and amazingly Moorish. And there you have it guys, how simple and easy are these to make? All you need to do is be very careful with the sugar syrup because it is hot and it can burn and nobody wants burnt little fingies. So be very careful, of course, small children away from the stove. If you like this video, of course, give me a thumbs up. That lets me know that you like this type of cooking and subscribe. I make desserts all the time and I love to share them with you so please hit that subscribe button and the video will be popped in your subscription feed. And if there's anything you'd like me to show you how to make please leave me a comment below. I'm searching for all different types of recipes all the time so feel free to share me your favorite. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye guys! Mm -hmm.